Yeah, well, hello, my name is Johanna Pirka and I'm an assistant professor, a computer scientist, a game developer at Graz University of Technology in Austria. I think the coolest part of my work is that I can always work with really cool new technologies and innovations and I'm able to work together with people from so many different fields. If you think of game development, developing a game and researching in the field of games requires um, so many different people to work together. People with knowledge in art, in psychology, in computer science, but also in music for instance. And I personally just love working and researching together in such a diverse and colorful field. Many Many people always think of computer science to be this boring field where you sit in the basement all day long and just sit, stare at this black PC screen. But again, for me, it's really creating those colorful words together with other people. And this is something which really inspires me every day. Um, the biggest challenge is, however, also to always finding a common language and finding the common goals for those projects together with people from those different disciplines. But that's also the fun part of my job. Um, my career path. When I was a kid, I was not really sure what I want to do next, what the future might bring for me. Um, and it was not like people recommended me to study computer science. However, I always liked playing video games. I always liked, I don't know, um, the PC itself, working with the PC. But I never thought that one day I might be able to create such wonderful game worlds myself. And during my studies, I just experienced what computer science actually means, that I can not only, like, I always wanted to be good in drawing, be good in writing, be good in arts. Um, but through computer science, actually, I got to experience what it means to be creative, because, like, with programming and game programming, I can create my thoughts, recreate my thoughts and make it accessible for everyone. They can v visit my dreams and interact with my dreams and everything which came out of my head. And this is so inspiring them for me. In my next life, I wouldn't do a lot of things um, differently. I think what many people don't see that also I experienced so many failures for every positive project, for every accepted paper, for every award, there are 10 or 20 things which did not went right. And I think it's so important to learn from these failures. So I take really every failure and to try to make the best out of it and to try to take it as a learning. So no, I wouldn't do things differently. Even though in my next life I would love to be an astronaut.